Yeah, I'm gonna make an egg for you. Bacon, egg, and cheese. Or sausage, egg, and cheese. Have a random assortment of food for Sahur, but I have these egg bites, Morning Star plant based sausage, green drink, cucumbers, and dates because those are sunny and great for hydration while fasting, raspberries, and of course, y'all know me and my coconut water during Ramadan. Nice glass of coconut water, and then Bay has yummy bagel with sausage, egg, and cheese. Good morning. Sabah al khair. I am feeling really good this morning. Had suhoor and, and um, I prayed, <laughs> got dressed, and I think I'm actually gonna go do my first workout of Ramadan. It's currently 6 a.m. Um, oh shit. Actually, it's 6.02. Will you be able to see that? Okay, it doesn't want to, but... <laughs> I don't know why I'm proving that to you. But anyways, I do F45 every morning. And they have a 6.15 a.m. class. I haven't signed up yet because I wasn't 100% sure if I was actually going to be up for this. But I think I'm going to go. So hopefully it's not booked. But I'm going to book the class. All right, it's too late to back out now, so this is what I'm wearing. I'll show you guys workout items in the mail. Um, I ordered from Amazon. I'll link these down below in case you guys are interested, but I'm wearing this top that I got from Amazon, and then I'm obsessed with the um, Athleta leggings. I love these. They're so good. And then I have my Lululemon hijab, and yeah, I gotta go before I'm late, so I will check back in at the end of my workout and tell you guys how it went but honestly I'm still like full and super hydrated from breakfast so I think this will be a good idea these are the shoes I like to wear by the way I need to wash them but they're the APL tech loom um, and they're so good I love them for working out they're like so cushiony I really hope I don't regret this my husband, <laughs> he didn't really feel up for it right now, but I'm gonna try and convince him to come with me tomorrow. <laughs>
All right, y'all. First workout of Ramadan is officially complete. I just got back into my car. Let me move the steering wheel out of the way. Well, well, that's the view you're getting. Um, it actually wasn't bad. It wasn't bad at all. This is the first time that I've done like super early morning workouts during Ramadan. And because I usually do it like in the evening. But I will, I have to say like this time doing it is like way, way better. I just felt like I had so much energy. I mean, I just ate like 45 minutes prior to the class. So yeah, I just felt like I had a lot of energy. I wasn't thirsty at all. I mean, today wasn't a cardio class. I feel like if I did cardio, I'd be feeling a little bit different. But even then, like, I just, like, never once had, like, the feeling or the need of drinking water. So I think I'm going to be an extra morning person this Ramadan because I'm thinking I'm just going to do morning workouts. Sorry, I keep looking down. I was, like, looking for hand lotion because my hands are so dry. But whatever, I'm going home anyways. But, yeah, today was mainly, like, a strength training day. I got some clips for you guys, so... Hopefully they look good, um, but yeah, I feel good. I'm gonna head home, I'm gonna shower, and I might take a nap, I might not. It's like, it's like 7.10 right now, and I'm really not that tired. Like, I could take a nap, but like, I don't know, we'll see. Yeah, I probably won't start work until like 10, 10 o'clock today, so I feel like I could take a nap. I'm gonna go home and uh, make my husband feel bad about not coming to my workout. <laughs> Okay, I am 100% going back to bed. I don't know what it was, but as my muscles started set settling into my chair and I was driving, I could just feel my eyes getting heavier and heavier. I'm gonna take a shower and just jump into bed for an hour or two, and I cannot wait. Hello, hello, good morning. <laughs> Look, he's wearing my sweater. Um, so I ended up knocking out until like 9.45, almost like 10, 10 a.m. this morning. Um, but it was a much needed nap. So I think that's gonna be my new routine, honestly, from now on. Risky and I have been working all morning. Hello, Ramadan <laughs> She's so cute. Um, we've been working all morning and Obviously didn't want to vlog that because it was boring, but right now I have to head to Target because we had a little mishap with this brand that I'm working with. They just like didn't send the product that we needed, which is kind of annoying. Like I'm doing a campaign with um, like for Earth Month and like they sent all of the refills, which is really great, but they didn't send the actual bottle for the refills. So I'm like, how am I supposed to show this in my content? But anyways, I'm just gonna go out and purchase the product myself because I just feel like it makes more sense within the content. So I'm gonna run over to Target and um, and then we have to film this video and they need it by like tomorrow morning, which that is just the real reality of being a content creator sometimes. Like brands take forever to approve content and send over briefs and all that, but they want the content like this. So unfortunately, that's what we have to do today. I'm a little annoyed, but it's a brand partner that I always work with, so it's fine, and I love the products, so it's all good. What are you doing? Okay, let's go. Excuse the lighting, but just went to Target and got back into my car. I only picked up a couple things. Um, I picked up the two products that I need for shooting content, and then I also got some pasta, because tonight I'm making some What's it called? Like, I'm having like that Ramadan hunger and brain fog right now. Um, I'm making beef circles, meatballs. Uh, I'm making meatballs. So and, um, initially I was gonna do spaghetti squash, but um, they didn't have any at Target and I don't have time to go to like Whole Foods or something. So I just got this chickpea spaghetti. Um, that actually is like pretty high in protein. It has 12 grams of protein per serving, which I think will be really good. It's exactly what we need. And then I also just got this one just in case. Um, I mean, I feel like it'll be fine, but this is a corn and rice blend pasta. It doesn't have as much protein in it and only it only has like three grams of protein. So not ideal, but yeah, that's all I got. And then I got some cream cheese because we have a bunch of bagels. Um, that needs to be eaten and our cream cheese is running low and then I just got a clear glass 
pitcher, I guess, um, because I broke my last one, which, yeah, you guys will see that behind the scenes sometime soon. But I was filming a mocktail recipe and then thankfully, alhamdulillah, it was done. Like we finished filming it, but then as I gave it like one more mix, it just combusted and shattered everywhere and it sucked, but it is what it is. So anyways, I'm gonna go home now. I'm so hungry. I'm getting to that like hangry point right now. They're just like, I don't wanna do anything, but oh, I'm like gonna give myself an hour um, of work and hopefully we can finish by like five and then I can just rest for the rest of the day or at least like sit on my couch and do work. Like I don't have to like rest completely. I just wanna be done with work, like physical work, you feel me? But anyways, off, back home we go. We're in the middle of finishing up this video. Whoa, how does everything look so red? I think that's a little better. Um, but yeah, we're filming this Vino slash just like Earth Month campaign. And this is like the last little bit where we're just showing all the product shots and everything's been going pretty smoothly. So yeah, so although I'm not a huge fan of quick turno turnovers, we always manage to get it done. Let me set y'all up so you can watch the rest of this. All right, I have exactly one hour to get iftar ready. So let's see if we can do this. I'm making meatballs and I found this like um, kosher Angus ground beef. And it's 85% lean, 15% fat. It says de-veined, soaked, and salted, so I don't know what that means. But anyways, I am gonna make that, and then um, I already have like the tomato sauce and everything, so all I really have to do is prep the ground beef. And I've made this recipe before, but it was a while ago, and I feel like, I feel like that video might not exist on my channel anymore, so in case it isn't, then here's another recipe for y'all. If you know how my YouTube recipes go, okay, they're not as produced as my TikTok one, so bear with me. I will try to post all the instructions below. This is the knife that sliced my finger in half, so I'm gonna be very careful today. Spicy. I'm gonna add a little bit of some cayenne pepper too. This is the secret ingredient that I'm now claiming as a secret ingredient, never technically was before, but some Worcestershire sauce. In case you guys are new here, I measure with the heart, so yeah. And then some panko breadcrumbs. This is what it's looking like so far. I'm also gonna add in some breadcrumbs. Just a little bit to start. And then I'll see if I wanna add more. Good. It's forming into a nice, oops. Why doesn't it want to focus? What the heck? Come on, focus on my meatball! It's forming into a nice ball, so I'm gonna make a bunch of these around yay big. Pretty simple. I got one, two, three, four, five, 15, 16 meatballs out of this, out of one pound. And now it is time to fry them. But I'm gonna use the Hour Place cast iron. Hopefully it fits the ball. Ooh, I don't know.
So I'm going to be adding this marinara sauce that I got from Costco just over the top of that. Since it's the first day of Ramadan, I kind of want to bake a cake and I've had this for so long. It's this grain-free chocolate cake mix. It's like made of almond flour, so I think I'm gonna make this. I don't have any icing for it, unfortunately, but I feel like I could probably make some if I really wanted. But I'm just gonna see how much batter this makes first. It doesn't smell very sweet. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good or bad thing. Ow! Why did I just do that? Never fails to have at least one cooking accident every single time I cook. It's almost Maghrib. Look how pretty the sky looks today. Wow. It's so gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I almost just accidentally mixed. Or uh, licks the voice. It's a very close call. Just gonna add a few chocolate chips in here. Looks delicious. Day one of fasting is complete. Bismillah. Meatballs are all done. They look so, so delicious. If y'all can see his face, he's like, hurry up and plate the damn food. Decided to go for the chickpea pasta today for some extra protein. Bite of food. Oh, you going in? Eating like there's no tomorrow. <laughs> Let me see it. Dinner was delicious, and now we're having cake. I didn't get to show you what it looked like when it came out, but this is what the slice looks like. And it actually turned out really good. We have some dairy-free Cool Whip on the side. It's by a brand called So Delicious, and they make like coconut whip. That's like low calorie and stuff like that. So it's very delicious, hence the name. Do you like my accent, love? I know. Anyways, I'm winding down. I'm editing that video that I had to film today. Um, we're just gonna chill for the rest of the night. Bottle next to me. Make sure you're staying hydrated. This Ramadan girlies. And I always put in this like stevia, like mio thing. I forget what it's called, but it's like those little like juice flavor thingies that are zero calories. It makes me want to drink more water. This one is like a strawberry watermelon flavor. Why are you stealing my blanket? <laughs> <laughs> and then I also have, you can't really see it. You can't see it, but I have my coconut water. Are you trying to warm up your cold feet on my warm legs? That's evil. <laughs> but anyways, I think I'm going to end the vlog here because it's been a very long day. 
thank you guys for watching. Um, spending the first day of Ramadan with me. Mmm, this cake is so good. I'm gonna link it on Amazon in the description in case you guys are curious. Because it's completely grain free and gluten free and delicious. Okay, love you guys. I will see you in the next Ramadan daily. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you donate using the link in my bio. And yeah, I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Do you want to say bye? <laughs> you want to be on camera? <laughs>